So this short video is about scalps. Um, I kind of think I might have done one of these before, but forgive me if that's the case. So scalp treatments uh, that I offer are for men and for women. Um, we can create the illusion of a hair follicle to either in people that have kind of a very short hair style um, between kind of like 0.5 and grade 1.5, uh, certainly no longer, um, to mimic the hair follicle. So it looks essentially like you have um, a full shaved head and you can work in areas. So there tends to be kind of like either side of a widow's peak, the, uh, the spot at the top of the head. Um, and also to create hair density, so the illusion of density within the hair. And that's a treatment that's actually quite popular also with ladies as well as gentlemen. Um, so if you have uh, coverage of hair, um, but the density's gone and you perhaps can see more pink of the scalp than you would prefer, then having your the illusion of density restored is a really nice technique to have done. Um, it's definitely a confidence booster. You don't have to worry about using fibres, making sure that you apply the fibre in the correct way and that if you're going out in the rain, it doesn't matter. You're not going to have any runoff from that. Um, and it's proven to be more and more popular. I think it's something that is sometimes incredibly expensive. Um, if you go, go to certain clinics, um, but it's not something that I believe I charge probably, probably even enough for. I think my prices are so reasonable. Um, I wouldn't like to think it was a deterrent, but to me, it's kind of a, a, a based on my time um, as opposed to the, the, I don't know quite what the right word is, as, a, as opposed to the like the marketed uh, version can't quite find the right term for it but it's a really it's a really simple and effective technique to create the illusion of hair and hair density and I don't feel that people should pay over the odds money um, because of the confidence that it can give if that makes sense I might need to redo this video once I've, I've fine-tuned those words um, but I think I charge a reasonable price. So um, have a look around. I'll hopefully try and tie this video in um, with some examples. I'll see if I can get clever in the editing. But if you've got any questions around um, creating that illusion of hair, then please do ask. Um, oddly enough, my two current clients are both barbers. Um, and so if it's good enough for a barber, it's obviously good enough for the rest of the world. So please, if you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel on here. Uh, there's, I'm trying to get content on there as and when questions come up for people um, to learn from. And if you haven't already, I'd be really grateful if you could hop over to my Facebook page. Debbie Collins at Permanent Cosmetics and give it a like, a follow and a share would be amazing. Um, thank you very much.